Hi MHZ candidates, uh, here these are the questions to be challenged for Maharashtra set 2025. First question is question number 2. This question is wrong question, definitely any of the option is not correct. The given option is option C. They provide that option C is correct but option C is also wrong. This is also wrong because as you can see that here whenever we are checking this the 2 1 then 1 3. So 2 1 then 1 3 means 2 3 should be present. 2 3 is not there as you can see. And when we are going with 3 1 and 1 2 then 3 2 should be present. So 3 2 is also not there. So it is not satisfying transitivity. So anyhow this is not a equivalence relation. Not a equivalence relation. Even equivalent, equivalent this type of relation is not there. It is actually equivalence. So equivalence means reflexivity, symmetry, symmetry and transitivity support. Here it is supporting reflexivity. That is okay. But it is not supporting uh, but it is not supporting this uh, transitivity. That is why it is wrong. Now, uh, 20, now in 9 number question, 29 number question as you can see that this is also wrong. So, because in this question if you are applying the algorithm, it is given 5 and 15 and Pn is 15 and 25. According to the algorithm after applying this formula, according to the algorithm of DDA, because this is the DDA algorithm. According to the apply, applying this, we are getting answer 7 and 17. 7, 17 is the answer. But this answer is given wrong. Because any of the option is not coming correct. So this question is also should be. Now the next question is the number of transmission. This is actually question number maybe not match because I am taking uh, C uh, question. Um, uh, there are question C. Okay, so according to that, so question number you can check. According to the C group, the question is 81. So this question is also wrong because there are three types of mode. One is simplex, another is up duplex, another is full duplex. But uh, they provide option A as the correct answer, but option B should be correct. So those who mark option B, they can challenge is the correct answer so you can challenge for this question next question is this one uh, that determine the language accepted by the finite automata this finite automata is not accepting any language because there is no final state no final state given so when the final state is not given how we can decide that which right so this question is also wrong so this question also should be drop any of the option wrong so that's why this question also be dropped you can challenge for drop drop this question everyone should get the marks for this this question should be dropped this question should be challenged those who mark option b uh, this question uh, actually wrong this question also should be dropped mark for all this question also should be dropped if you have any doubt in any other question you can write down the question in the comment we will check 2nd July is your uh, final date. So, before that you have to submit and you have to challenge. Hope for the best. All the best. If you are new to this channel, then definitely subscribe to the channel. Click the bell icon to be connected with Unicode. Thank you.